en, två, två och tre Det här är Simon G, det här är mina problem En och två och två och tre Det här är Simon G, det här är mina problem Har du snackat med Juffi och Petrina? Nej, vadå? De ska till Los Angeles och köra stand på Fråga om vi vill följa med Det verkar ju svimba det Mm Mm, men jag kommer inte ha råd att åka med. Nej. Jag har inte synd. tillräckligt med pengar. Nej, synd. Mm. Det är synd för jag har liksom alltid haft eh, ambition att göra alltså, Hollywoodfilm. Mm. Mm. Vad va då typ av Hollywoodfilm? Holly, Hollywoodfilm. Ja, men komedi eller... Ja, jag har en, en idé mm. som är, det är som ett kammarspel. Mm. Så allting utspelar sig på samma ställe. Mm. Det är i ett rövhål. Och så är det två... Och, Eh, bajskorvar. Det är hela filmen. Ja, ah, men Som... eh, åttan. Uh. Uh, ja, det är alltså, skitball i det, men mm. är lite svårt för kammarspel. Mm. Alltså så här, om man säger så här sitcom Seinfeld-avsnittet, du vet, Chinese Restaurant. Mm. När man då inser efter ett tag in i avsnittet att hela avsnittet kommer att liksom utspela sig i det här begränsade utrymmet. Mm. Då, då får jag Klaus då förbi. Mm. Det känns som vi kommer vara kvar här ett tag. Fan också. Jag tror jag hänger med dem till LA. Det... Ja. Ja, men fan, jag har inte så mycket kvar att hämta här i vinter i Sverige nu. Jag får knappt några gig sen Valbäck-turnén och... Sjöndrika vill inte träffas längre, så mm. jag tror att det bara komma iväg. Mm, gör det. Mm. Sen fick jag ett mejl också från en Hollywood-agent. Som, uh, jag släppte boken Simon såna 20 dagar. Just det, den ser jag ju i boken. Mm, den kom ut där för ett tag sedan, då fick jag en sån mejl från någon... Hollywood-agent som sa att han kunde pitcha den till film eller tv. Ah, fan, fett. Han skrev att om jag är i LA någon gång så kan vi ta ett möte där. Mm, jag gör det. Det är mm. skitbra. Jag kommer få vara kvar här. Mm. Jag får väl sätta upp min sån kammarspel i källaren på Pizzeria Rex. Mm. Det är den budgeten som jag har. Ja. Mm, fan vad nice. Mm. Vad funkar det igen? Det ser för jävligt ut här ju. Mm. Ja, det gör ju det. Alltså jag, jag har städat fast bara på mitt rum. Men vi kanske kan dela upp det så att vi tar var sin vecka när vi har ansvar för städningen. Ja, men då, jag kan ta den här veckan fast jag gör det imorgon för jag ska förbereda inför kväll. Jag bjöd in Hans Steven som agenten som jag snackade om. Mm. Han, han kunde inte komma men hans assistent, hon älskar tydligen stand-up. Så hon skulle komma och kolla när vi kör. Ja, okej. Okay. You know when you have BDSM sex, you're supposed to have a, a safety word so you can stop before things get out of hand. But that's like interrupting sex is like the worst thing. So therefore I always come up with these really hard safety words like uh, A, B, C, 1, 2, 3, slash 7, B, slash 89. So that you know, you're going at it and your partner's like, 1, 2, 3, stop! And I'm like, that's wrong. Let us keep on going. And I'm like a computer, get it wrong three times and I'll never stop. You guys remember the Swedish chef on the Muppet Show, right? Yeah. 
He's Swedish. He, I, I get how it's all fun and games to you. Like he just goes nerdly, nerdly, nerdly. It's all, it's all fun. But let me tell you, as someone who actually understands Swedish, that guy is saying some racist shit. Honestly. Yeah, he's just. Do you, you just hear nerdly, nerdly, nerdly? I'm going. Ah, oh, man, did he just use the N word, nerdly? And when Nelson Mandela died, I thought, oh no, not Uncle Ben. He made such delicious rice. Hi. Hello. Gloria. I'm Simon. Ornament Media Group, Steven's assistant. Ah, you're, you're the assistant. Yeah, I love the stand-up. Thanks uh, yeah. a lot. Um, the joke about Uncle Ben. Yeah? That was vaguely racist. You think? Oh, 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 hey, sorry, hey. man. Hey, what's up, man? Hey, what y'all just taking a piss? Yeah. I right, go right here, bro. Go right here. I'm just getting dressed for my okay. next set. You're a comedian too? Yeah, I'm a comedian, man. Yeah. By the way, hi. I'm, I'm Prime Minister, God's gangster, man. Cool, man. Yeah, did yeah. you see my set? Yeah, I did see your set. Your set was great. It was great. Yeah. You didn't think it was uh, vaguely racist? Vaguely racist? Nah. How could man? It was great. Nothing was wrong with your set, man. You did a great job. You did a great show. Everyone loved you. Thank you. You were extremely funny. I really enjoyed the jokes about bondage. Is that something that you're into in real life as well? So now I told her that you're in a BDSM. Yeah. But she's a bit smart, so I can't think about testing it. I'm going to write a little bit, so it's nice. But you know that she works for the guy that I'm going to meet. Ska på möte med, va? Ja, fast det spelar ingen roll, kanske. Nej, egentligen ingenting. Du, kör, kör hårt för fan. Ja. Det, jag unnar dig det. Ja, tack. Mm. I gotta say, Simon, I, I love the book. The, the, the story, the idea, it's, it's great. Thanks. But there's problems. Problems? So when the book was released here in the U.S., at least two critics called it vaguely racist. Yeah, I saw some of those reviews. Look at this. Yeah. Um, I did some notes here. When when you when you look at this the drawing of, of a black man that, that you drew. Yeah. Um, look, look at this guy right here. I can understand those critics. Yeah, but it's a little bit different culture in Sweden, how you look at those things. Uh, when the book came out in Sweden, uh, got a lot of press, but nobody mentioned a word about racism. I just draw uh, in that way because I thought it was funny to draw like they did in uh, old school Mickey Mouse cartoons and stuff like that. Like uh, how they draw black people there. but. I'm not a racist at all. Uh, actually, I live with a black woman right now, Petrina. Why, the Gloria? Yeah, she's on the phone. She wonders now if I'm alone at home, but I don't know how to answer. Well, you can be that if you want to go out. I can go out. I talked to some TV and movie producers, and I realized that it's going to be harder to sell the book than I thought. It really doesn't look good when you Google your name, Simon. Yeah, I know. I know. I know. I know. It really doesn't look good when you Google your name, Simon. It doesn't? You, you, um, um, you were touring with this Swedish comedian, Peter Wahlbeck. I Googled him too. Is he racist? Uh, no. Maybe, maybe he's vaguely, vaguely racist. Vaguely but racist. Just, just vaguely. Lite tips är att du städar upp, för jag ser ut som ett jävla rövhållare inne. Ja, jag ska städa. Men jag tänker så här, jag städar, du sticker ut några timmar. Ring Simon också så att han kommer hem. Så kanske ni kan vara ute typ till 4-5 någonting. Så fixar jag här och bjuder henne hem, hem, hem liksom. Okej. Så om vi inte är möjliga att sälja 120 dagars assignment, har du några andra idéer? Någonting som vi kunde pitcha för tv eller film? I got this idea of a chamber piece. Uh, it's about 
two pieces of shit inside an asshole. <laughs> genius. The whole movie takes place inside an anus. <laughs> you think that would work? It's great. I love it. I love it. You think we can pitch that? I think we should. I think, I think I'm going to pitch that. Ah. Okay. Pitch it with the big dogs. Um, who, would, who do you think should, should star in a, in a movie like that? I was thinking like maybe Chris Rock and Morgan Freeman. Um, Black actors. Yeah, why not? You think black people look like pieces of shit, Simon? No. I just like Chris Rock and Morgan Freeman, that's all. I could star in the movie myself. I could play the leading role. I can play a piece of shit. I'd just dress up in a brown piece of shit suit and... Yeah, I'm white, but I'm, I can maybe paint my face brown. Black face. Brown face. That's vaguely racist, Simon. You think? Vaguely racist. Ska vi inte nåt säga som inte är ramen? Jag tror det finns så tai. Det. Hello. Hey. I just got off the phone with the vice president of RK TV Studios and. Um, I told them that I was talking to you. They, uh, they, they love the idea of your book, but uh, she needs to actually see it. You didn't bring it? No, no. Um, she just called. I'm, I'm, um, I'm in Koreatown. I just had lunch. Where are you? That's uh, actually close to where we are now. If you can pick me up, and we'll get the book at my place. I live close, close to Koreatown. All right. <laughs> Wait a minute. I know this guy. Prime Minister God's gangster. No, that's not me. That's not you? I'm, I met a guy with uh, exactly the same shoes, like blinking shoes, black guy, baseball cap. You think all blacks look the same? I think that's vaguely racist, dog. Oh, sorry. Uh, I don't believe you guys, man. Um, sorry, just, we'll get the book. Sorry about this, Petrina. That, that piece of shit, she's supposed to clean up here. Okay, you don't do cleaning yourself? Come here. Is it Steven? Come right up. You have a slave, Simon? That's vaguely racist. Men det kan väl finnas en hel värld där ute? Det har jag svårt att tro. Men har du aldrig varit nyfiken på hur det skulle vara att komma ut i den stora världen? Nej. Jag trivs bra här inne i rövhålet. Multitalented!